everyone welcome to Murka Creations today it's time for some painting if you saw the last video I made over a credenza for our walk-in closet and I talked about making a painting to go on the wall on top of that credenza right there so that's what I'm doing today and uh, I will also make a Japanese inspired painting for a window in our master bedroom. So stay tuned for this. For my first painting I've been inspired by this photo I found online. It's a Japanese flower arrangement, Ikebana. I have already given my canvas two coats of a light greyish colour and now I'm painting the edges in a black acrylic paint. And then I'm off to the background. It will look nothing like the inspiration piece. And right about here I wanted to try the crackle medium. So I'm putting that on a little bit on the edges and then went over it with a darker color to get some crackle effect but I had a very hard time to produce those crackles so I'm working my way around the canvas creating this cloudy effect just blending white black and gray shades and I'm doing that with a sponge and then on the very edges I worked very hard to create those crackles I finally managed I only use uh, water-based acrylic paint for my paintings it doesn't smell anything and it dries very quickly and I am impatient if you're new to my channel hi I am Marika and on this channel I do lots of DIYs I do thrift flips trash to treasure a few dupes, renovation of my home and I even do some pottery and some painting anything creative really please join me hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and join my YouTube family the background is done and now it's time to paint the flower arrangement in the upper right corner you can see the inspiration photo so you can see what I'm looking at and what I'm trying sort of to recreate. I'm playing around with different shades to create depths in the painting. I will just uh, let you enjoy the process here with the soft music.
and here it is hanging above the credenza that I made over in my previous video go and check that out if you haven't already look at this I think it's a perfect place for it made for this place and you can see the crackle effect here very subtle but it's there I made it tell me what you think I think it's very calm looks beautiful same color scheme as the rest of the room and here you can see the tiny flowers up close you could hardly see them before For my next painting, I'm going into the master bedroom. This window right here, this is how it looked from the very beginning. And then I made some faux stained window effect. But you could still see those bricks behind the window. You can see that right here. It was okay, but I wasn't a hundred percent so now I have stripped it and painted the windows in a light grayish color that I used for the other painting I just made but I left a little bit of that faux stained feel on the corners and that Japanese sun so I had to go with the Japanese theme here so I'm using my acrylic paint and here I will just freehand, I have a picture to look at. I will make two cranes dancing together. And beside the Japanese sun, I will paint some mountain tops. And the only colors I use for this entire painting is uh, black and white and mix them together to create different shades of grey. Putting on the color and blending while it's still wet to get a softer transition between the colors. And here underneath the sun I'm continuing with smaller mountain peaks. Same procedure here. And now I'm painting a little tea house on the lake side. These traditional Japanese paintings were made with watercolors 
but I'm using my acrylic paint. And now I'm creating some bamboo branches, different shades of grey and black here as well, starting with the lighter leaves and then put the darker ones on top. And then it's just a matter of signing my painting. Et voila, here it is looking very pretty I think tell me what do you think of my paintings today did you have a favorite let me know in the comments you know I love to read your comments I'm so grateful to hear what you have to say about uh, my creations if you like this video and videos like this consider subscribing and hit that like button as well. It will help my channel to grow and I can spend more time creating inspirational content for you. My aim is to upload one video per week. If you are inspired and you want to see more straight away, just hit that uh, playlist icon appearing on the screen right here. Just click and enjoy. Thank you so very much for watching. See you soon again in my next one. Until then, take care. Bye.